Okay. Present on this device, please. I need to put this away. I'm always just like... I'm always just hitting stuff and like making random noises during literally every single presentation. Then I listen over to it and I'm like, <laughs> like the entire time or I'm making like weird noises or I'm just hitting my phone with like a pencil or something and it's bad. <laughs> okay. Okay, there. I'm wrestling with the pen set right now. This is a really awkward picture to have on the title while I'm doing all this. Okay. Okay, so. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> So, this is going to be absolute chaos. FYI, this has over 50 slides. I don't, I don't really know where I ended up at. Um, probably around 60, maybe. I don't know, man. <laughs> um, I, I actually cut some music videos out because um, I just... It was taking so long to make this thing. It took me literally all day to day, you know, not counting... Not counting the extremely long nap that I took and the fact that I slept in until, like, 10. Um, but, yeah. Here are my favorite music videos. The Superior Opinion, because my opinion's better than yours. I mean, I mean, clearly. And, yeah, let's just get into this before it's, like, a whole um, five-year-long presentation. Which it probably will be, but, you know. Okay, so we're starting out with Wallows, of course, you know. Just thought I might as well start it out with them because they're kind of like my band, sort of, even though their fans are bad. Um, yeah, so our very first music video and the number the number three spot. I do, I'm trying not to freaking stutter the entire time. It's so annoying. It's so annoying when that happens. Um, but yeah, number three spot, Scrawny. I just... I really like this music video, and the song itself really matches with it. I really like the, like, guitar things. It sounds like punches, sort of, and it just, it really fits with it. It really matches with it, and it's just a really cool theme to go with, because, like, it's not the most common theme to see a dude, like, in a boxing ring, at least not in, like, alt music. It's probably, there's probably a lot of that in rap music and stuff, but, you know, and it's kind of funny just because there's a, these are, like, so just, three skinny guys, you know, like, they're not, they're not really buff, so it's kind of fun just to, like, see them doing stuff, and yeah, the song message actually correlates with the music video, which is pretty cool, um, you don't see that a lot now for some reason, especially with AJR, <clears throat> number two, I put okay, um, I always really love this music video, it's just been, like, one of my favorites of theirs ever since I first found out about them, um, this song is actually what I was known for. Um, Pauline, stop texting me. <laughs> stop texting me right now. No, I thought it was on. <laughs> I thought it was do not disturb mode. Okay, no, no, we're not We're not doing this right now. We're not doing this right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to save that for later so I can like go on after. I don't want to spoil everything right now. Um, <laughs> I'm glad you like it. I'm glad you like it. Um, so, uh, where, where was I even at? Oh, yeah, Paulina always associated me with this music video, so it was always kind of mine. I also remember this was in 2020, so I used to put my, I used to put goggles on my Among Us character. <laughs> like, Brayden has goggles on this music video. I just love, I love the themes of this one. It's just them goofing around. One part, they're, like, in, a, in the drive through and they're, like, ordering stuff. I like that part, because it's just, like, realistic, you know? It's pretty funny. And yeah, this is just them hanging out. I like it a lot. Um, and <laughs> I went down. I'm gonna warn you in advance. I went down a rabbit hole with these pictures, dude. <laughs> I did not know there were so many Lin Manuel Miranda memes on the internet. <laughs> um, yeah, we got honorable mentions. Now this is. There were probably even more. I was gonna put even more honorable mentions for this. Band. I don't know why I just I don't know why I didn't just say Wallows. I just said I'm acting all vague. I'm like this band. Um, but yeah. I was gonna put more, but I was like the I would just have every single music video of theirs, literally. Um but yeah, um this is Nobody Gets Me Like You. This one's really underrated amongst the community. I was this one it was super close, super close to being in the top three. Um, yeah, I just really like it. It's Brayden's little solo moment. 
And it's just kind of like, it's a fun music video. It's a fun song, too. I really like the song. The party setting is pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's just a fun music video. And remember when, <laughs> I like this one. This, oh, this is such a good song. Their songs just scratch my brain. I love their <laughs> songs so much. Um, but we're not talking. We're not talking about the songs. Okay, we're talking about the music videos. So, um, this one's just them in a maze. They're just like playing their instruments. It's really simple, but I think it's. I mean, obviously they're gonna make it funny, but like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure the reason that they like stretch they stretch their faces out and stuff is because like. You're supposed to, like, it's supposed to symbolize you slowly forgetting them. Because it's about, like, remembering and, like, forgetting memories from the past and stuff. So it's kind of like you're forgetting their faces as the music video goes along. I don't know. At least someone in the comments said that. But, like, I trust people. I trust strangers online with my life. So, like, I can trust them with with the random theory. Uh, (laughs) Internet safety is important, kids. Please don't. When I first met Paulina... I said my first and last name, like, immediately, on accident. Well, not on accident. It was, like, I misunderstood a question she asked, and I just said it, and she was like, oh, wait. <laughs> she was like, wait, that's not what I asked, but okay. And I was like, oh, well, good thing you're not a child predator, I guess. Anyways, that was completely off topic. Um, pictures of girls. I love this one. This one's just, this one's just so summery. I love it. Um, Man, I'm just... I have such a bias for some of these because I just like, I love the songs. I love this song so much. So it was really close to being the top three. But, like, in the end, the music video in itself is just kind of them, like, hanging out. That's what all their music videos are. <laughs> they, don't, they don't really have any intense ones except for, um... Oh, I just completely blink whenever I make these things. What's it called? It's the one about this doctor. Oh, Treacherous Doctor. It's like a whole, like, claymation, I think. It's pretty, it's awesome. Um, I thought probably should have been in the top three because that one probably took way longer than the rest of these did. Literally, what even is my top one spot? Oh, it's, okay, you probably already know what it is. Wait, oh, no, another one. <laughs> um, another one is virtual aerobics. Yeah, that one was literally going to be in the top three, but I switched it out last second, um, and I didn't even put it in the honorable mentions, so... That was kind of stupid of me. But yeah, I like that one. Just because it's the first one I saw of them. It was like, it's literally the very first time I saw their faces. So it's kind of, it was, it's cool. It has some sentimental value, you know. And the winner. Yay. <laughs> There's Chi Chi. I just put a bunch of random pictures from my camera roll. Um, These days. I mean, I mean, you were probably expecting that. Just... You just, you already know, you know, like, it's very, it's very bright, it's very colorful, it has a girl in it, it has a house, I, I love those things, <laughs> the reasonings, the reasonings are gonna be so bad in this, um, it has a lot of, like, oranges and yellows and stuff, it has a lot of warm colors in it, which I love, um, I love this girl's bedroom a lot, it's just, the entire thing is just so happy, and it makes me really happy, which is why, it's my favorite. And, yeah. She makes me want to paint my walls yellow, even though I would probably hate it after a month. Okay, and 21 Pilots with a typo. Wow. We, we, we are already starting out with the typos. Um, a few slides in. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I just... <laughs> what did I put this year? I think I... I think... I think I made, made a mistake, maybe. I just... <laughs> Uh, the, the pure the pure terror on his face okay i guess we're, i guess we're moving on from that i don't know <laughs> you just you just don't question anything okay so third shy away um this would uh this one's definitely put up here because of sentimental reasons you know it came out and naturally you were the first person i talked to about it i was like whoa did sydney see this and i went and texted you about it so of course like that plays into a lot of it. <laughs> and the music video itself is just cool. You know, it's like the very start of an era, of the new era. And like, yeah, it was just, it's like kind of their first release where I was like really into them and I was actually keeping track. Um, But yeah, 
Yeah, that's pretty much... I would listen to some of their songs, but, like, I wasn't, like... For this one, I was actually like, oh, wow, I can't wait until Shy Away releases, you know? And, yeah, Tyler's hair in this is super cool, too. I love the buns so much. And, yeah, it's just a fun one. Level of concern. This one is underrated. Why does no one talk about this music video? So, yeah, this was, um... I always really liked this one. Especially Josh's part. Josh is superior in this music video. Like, Tyler's alright, you know. But Josh, like, his whole setup is so cool. With the lights and everything. That is awesome. That reminds me of, um... Frightmares. You know, Lagoon. Um, they put... They do that in some rooms in there, and it's awesome. They do it in the clown house, and it's the best. I love I love neon lights, I guess. I'm just <laughs> and, um, yeah. Tyler's pretty cool in it, I guess. His is just nothing compared to, like, Josh's, but, you know. Also, Debbie Ryan's in it, so, I mean, you can't really go wrong. And Jenna, I guess. Debbie Ryan, though. <laughs> I told you. I told you. Um, Stressed out. This is just a good one, you know? Like, it's just that one that everyone sees somehow. Like, I saw this... I remember seeing this a long time ago, and I was like, what is going on? Especially on the handshake part, I was just, like, so confused. I was like, what are these two random dudes doing, and why are they... Just why? And I was like, dang, that was a while ago. If I ever even told you about that, that was a long time ago. That's weird. Um... Yeah, it's just cool. I really love the entire idea of it. Like, they just go back. They're just really good at music videos, aren't they? But, like, I love how they're just in Tyler's room or whatever, and Josh has his drums, and it, like, has... It has just, like, their band name on it, but it's, like, kind of a work in progress still. It's cool. It's really cool. And the backpacks, the scooters, just everything. Everything about it. Um, Fairly local. See, I... I didn't realize how much I liked other ones more than this. It's It was really hard putting this not in the top three because I love this music video so much. Um, would I love it if Tyler weren't so hot? Probably not, honestly. <laughs> um, it's this blurry face part. It's this blurry face part right here. Right here. Oh yeah, these are the gifs that I made a while back at like three <laughs> that I tried to send to you, but it didn't work. These are it. I don't know if you remember it, but like... It was like a week ago, maybe two. Ew, that's, there's no way that was two weeks ago. But, yeah, it's just a really cool video. It's not, I like the brighter ones, as you can probably tell. And this, so this one just doesn't really, it's really cool though. It's, you know, in terms of like good music videos, this would probably be in the top three. Like if I didn't have a bias towards, <laughs> towards just like, you know, happier things, I would definitely put this in top three. I love, <laughs> this is just. This is a bad ranking system. Um, the winner... Ooh, woo. Please move on. <laughs> okay. And, yeah, the winner is Choker. As you would probably... I think you know most of these first place ones. It's just, like, the other ones. Um, ow! 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 I got my finger stuck in the pen thing, and it hurts so bad. Um, I'm being so loud right now. So, this one... This one's just fun. Like, there's really no other reasoning behind it. It's just fun. Like, Josh just running a store and then playing the drums randomly behind the shelf is kind of funny for some reason. And, like, uh, Jim's in it, too. And it's really cute. And, like, the little the little Jim figurine. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really excited about that. Um, this picture on the left is so aesthetic. Not aesthetic. It's It's satisfying to look at. It's just, like... It's a really bright music video. I love it. I love Tyler's orange beanie. You know, he really switched it up a little bit. Um, and yeah. I heard something. Um, okay. <laughs> Here's the cursed younger them. I just, I cropped Adam out of some of these pictures, by the way. <laughs> I tried my best, okay? So, bang, dang, that's a low quality picture. Um, bang. Number three, Bang is just like, this was their very first song release, and I just remember, I remember sitting in the chat room, the like premiere thing, they had the premiere up for like a long time, of course, because it's AJR, and I made some friends on the chat room on YouTube, and I would just like talk to them. I remember my mom used to like bring me to the gym with her, 
and we would just like walk on the treadmills or whatever and I was just on that chat room the entire time just like talking to these random people and yeah that's pretty much all the memories I have associated with it I really like the part where he brings his like cane thing out I'm sure there's I'm sure there's another word for it I'm not a gambler so I don't really know but I really like the part where I mean Jack you probably know who I'm talking about I'm, I'm not talking about freaking Ryan over here um <laughs> Yeah, but I like the part where he grabs his cane thing out and he, like, puts it on the board or whatever. I don't know. I was obsessed with this, though. I would always, like, kind of... I'd, like, daydream about being in it. And I was like, oh, I really wish I was one of those people wearing the masks. But then I would be like, oh, wait, that would be awkward. Because, like, some of them are... That part where they're naked is weird. Can we, like, talk about that for a second? That is weird. Why would they do that? Um, but yeah, I need to put this freaking pen thing down. See, I knew this was going to happen. If there's anything, if there's anything in my reach that I can touch, I'm just going to play with it. Just be warmed. That's why I, that's why I break everything. <laughs> I, lo- I love when that happens. It happens every single time. Okay. Number two, way less sad. You know, as you could probably guess. Um, yeah, I just love this one. This is probably, I honestly, when these first came out, I was like, why are they just randomly switching to them playing instruments in different places? Like, of course... Okay, so, they're not good music videos. Like, <laughs> like in terms of music videos, these make no sense. But I love them still. Just because, like, they have the guys in it, you know? <laughs> but, like, they're not good music videos, really. I mean, they could be worse, but, like, they're the newer ones are way worse. But this is... These look really good compared to freaking the DJ is crying for help and I won't. But I mean, like, these aren't good music videos. I just love them for some reason. Bing is probably better than this one in terms of just like making sense. But um, yeah, I still really love these ones where they're just like switching places and playing instruments just because like they're fun, you know, and they're fun in a way that's still like kind of pleasing to see because you get to see him doing different things instead of just changing shirts a bunch of times yeah or running you're literally just running yeah um or being stranded on an island (laughs) and just randomly running to a see i don't get it i don't get it i don't get why they picked a political song to put freaking what's his name over and like replace jack in it i don't i don't get it I'm sorry, this is a, this isn't, you know, this isn't going to be a rant towards AJR, but, like, come on, come on. But, yeah, anyways, I, I like this one a lot. And the song is banger. The song is banger. Okay, honorable mentions. He looks like, he looks like, he looks like my uncle in this. Anyways. <laughs> No, it's the smile. They, like, have the same... That is weird. Do you think that... Is that why... Is that why I'm, like... He's, like, my celebrity father? Because he looks like my uncle, and my uncle's, like, a good dad to his kids? Anyways. Um... (laughs) I'm just uncovering... I'm uncovering some things over here. So, we're in the house down. I shouldn't have picked this color. This is an ugly color of blue. Can we just, like, agree on that? That's an ugly color of blue. Anyways, this, this, is, this has gone far away from music videos, and it's just ranking the colors now. Like, let's just rank every single color on this. Um, Yeah, burn the house down. This one is... This one... And I know I'm going to get hate for this. I know I'm going to get hate for not putting it in the top three. It's so good. It's so good. I really, I honestly really miss this era when they would make, because this is, see, this is how you make a song that, like, actually relates, not a song, this is how you make a music video that actually relates to the song, because this entire music video actually revolves around the message of the song, you know, they don't just throw in a random concept over a song about politics, like, Three O'Clock Things is about, like, racism and they're just like uh well you know let's just make this dude play as us and everything like no no you don't do that you do not do that this is a good way of like 
of just making a music video about it without shoving it into people's faces. You know, like, it's a fun way to do it. It's a unique way to do it. Like, you know, people aren't just riding carts around with masks, with masked people, you know. And the jumpsuits were a look. I love the jumpsuits on them. Those things, whenever I go to the temple, you have to wear these, like, you have to wear stuff that looks like that, basically, to, like, get, um, drowned. Well, not drowned. <laughs> <laughs> to get drowned, no, to get dunked, you know, you have to wear those. So whenever I put those on, I'm always like, oh, it's like I'm in the Burn the House Time music video. I want to take a selfie. I was going to do that the last time I went. I was like, oh, I should take a selfie for Sydney so she can see I'm like in the, I'm like a person in the Burn the House Time music video. But it is like forbidden to use your phone in the, in the temple. And I would literally probably get dragged out if I took a picture in there. So. Oops. Um, <laughs> someday, maybe. Someday. Also, Adam, why is his head so long? <laughs> this is, oh, I suck at this. I like Jack Matt's chest hair. Um, come hang out. Oh, I forgot I was still in the honorable mentions. Um, come hang out. This is just a good one. You've already, you already went over why I like this one so much. It's just like a really fun environment. It's really creative. See, this is also about the song, you know, it's not a hard thing to make a song about, you know, it's not as creative, but like, it's fine, you know, because it's, it makes sense. And it's fun. Like, it shows all of them just doing their thing. Also, the behind the scenes, I was about to say the behind the scenes music video. The behind the scenes of this music video is like, the best. I really like the part where Jack takes his shirt off. I just gonna I'm just gonna keep saying like simpy things and then just moving on to the next part. <laughs> this is so bad. This is probably like 50 minutes long already. Okay, first place. Wow. And there's a picture of the sunset that I took today. I take pictures of sunsets every single day, honestly. Then I like, whenever there's a sunset, I'm always like, oh, well, maybe I shouldn't take a picture of this because I've already taken a picture of like the same looking one over and over and over again. Then I'm like, oh, well, whatever. So yeah, now I have a picture of a sunset. Like, shut up. I have a picture of the sunset, like, every day. And Bummerland. You know, of course, naturally. Um, this is just... This is just such a fun song. It's such a... The vibes are perfect. And this is just... This is my first song release on AJR Twitter, so, like... And it was just... It was probably the most joy I had felt at that part... At that time. Just, like... Being with a bunch of people who understood me and just like celebrating the release of this new song and this new music video. It was just the absolute best. Like nothing can compare I guess nothing can really compare to just being just like the first time that you experience being with people that like you can actually be around and just show your personality around, like, for the very first time. Because this was back when I had, like, my stupid friend group that just, like, my popular girlfriend group and just literally no one to talk to about anything involving this. And when I did talk about it, I was, like, you know, mocked about it. So just being on AJ Twitter and just talking about this and just being able to enjoy it without feeling bad about actually, like, being crazy about it or whatever, um, it was awesome. And it was back when, this was honestly AJ of Twitter's peak, because it was just a really close group of just tight-knit friends, you know? Patty made, I don't think they go by Patty anymore. So I think that part, they're a K-pop stand now. <laughs> the person whose name we don't speak of. Um, made us all profile pictures. I actually told you about that. That's the very first thing I told you about. Huh. That's weird. Anyways, yeah, they just made us all profile pictures. I was the boat, I think. Yeah, I was the boat. I was either the boat or the rock. I think I had a choice, and I was like, no, I'll take the boat. Um, yeah, I was always really jealous of Ashley. She had the parachute. Freaking Ashley. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I gotta, I gotta find out. I gotta come up with my um, simpy comment. Um, I really like Jack Metz's face. Okay, glass animals. <laughs> glass animals. These guys just don't have any funny pictures that I have, so we just we just went with the normal one, I guess. My hand is really itchy. Okay, so number three, I put 
your love. This one's just a, this is kind of trippy one. I like it just because it's it's fun for like my brain, you know. It's just fun. <laughs> it's just really all the music and stuff that I indulge in is just for my brain, honestly. It's just like what can my <laughs> what helps my brain be quiet, and this is one of them. Your love. This song is such a bop. I love this song so much. Um, I, I guess that's all I have to say about that. Life itself. Oh, this one's fun. I wish that diners like this existed, where you can just like go in and like dine. <laughs> I mean, no idea. I, no idea. What was I even saying? <laughs> just. Oh, this is bad. My mind just died. I think. What was <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Wait. Okay. You know what? We're just moving on. We're just moving on. This girl's really pretty, though. I like her. We're just kidding. All right. Oh, whoa. peep the Hamilton soundtrack in the background of this. I have no idea. What? What even? Okay. And the talkie back in the background. We're just... Last night was rough, man. That was last night. No, it wasn't. Was it Thursday night? When did I watch Hamilton? I think it was Thursday night. Yeah, it was. It was. Um, see, oh, oh yeah, this is first place, season two, episode three. This one has no honorable mentions, because they don't have very many music videos. The only honorable mention I can think of is Heat Waves, maybe, but it's just him walking through a city with a wheelbarrow, and I only like it because it's, like, warm outside, and I just like warmth. <laughs> um, yeah, I just like this one. This girl's a mood. I like... I always sit in chairs like that, so I really appreciate the representation. And it gets really cool. For some reason, I couldn't find any pictures of it, but it literally turns, like, 8-bit. And it's awesome. She does eat that mayo with a spoon, though, which is pretty messed up. But yeah, just the vibes of it. They're, the vibes of their music videos are pretty fun. This song in itself isn't my favorite, but, like, you know. This is probably one of the lower songs in that album. Which means nothing, because I love that album so much, but, you know. Grandson! Oh, I miss Pink Sun so much. I wish he would keep his hair pink. Why? That was so awesome. Like, I think he was embarrassed by it, but it's honestly the best. Like, just imagine, like, this really... This guy who just goes and yells, like, pretty much all about politics and just these really hot takes on everything, and he just, like, speaks his... He just speaks his, like, um, opinions out to the world. And he just has pink hair. Like, that's iconic. I don't know why he didn't keep that. Maybe, I don't know. And it looks good. It looks way better than the black hair, not gonna lie. It doesn't look good in this picture. For some reason, I couldn't find a picture that, like, showed him after he washed the dye out. But I, I really liked it. Um, so first I put Zen. I got a really bad screenshot of it because for some reason it's impossible to find pictures of music videos on the internet. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why that sounded so sarcastic. Um, but yeah, I just went on and I just took a random screenshot and I was like, okay, that's good enough. Um, a lot of this is actually, a lot of this is a lyric video, but at the end of the very end, it just shows all of them. So that's grandson. It's got ex ambassador. I think. It's got the lead singer. And it's got k Flay, which is just a really cool combo. I really love this song. And it was during quarantine, too. So, like, it's just... It's a really cool music video. And it just has a good message, you know? Like, just let... It, you gotta let it... You gotta let it out sometimes, you know? Um, then a second, I put running... Wait a minute. Oh, I didn't even put a number on that one. A second, I put running for my shadow. Because it's just... It's iconic. It, it... I like it. It's... Yeah, it's perfection. I don't know why I didn't know that it existed sooner. It's... Why is it not talked about? <laughs> it makes me so mad that I just barely found out about this. It's so cool. Yeah, that's pretty much it, though. Um, Just, like, these two go so well together. And it's so... I was just, like, fangirling early when I first saw this. I was like, whoa, they are actually in the same room. Or they're outside right now, so they're actually in the same um mile radius. But yeah, that's fun. I wish that did they do any like interviews together or something? Cause that would be awesome. I think that they're 
they would be best friends. It's so random that he did it with grandson, but that's cool. And first place. Oh, yeah, because grandson doesn't have any really good. He doesn't have that many music videos, actually. And most of them are in black and white theme, which I will talk about more here. At number one, we have Dirty. Um, yeah. See, my problem with Death of the Os- with the with Death of an Optimist is, um, just don't, don't mind the actual typos in my words. Sometimes I make typos while I'm saying things and it's actually concerning. And I don't, I'm not, I don't mean like just like miss saying something. It's just like, I literally say typos that I make a lot of the time. And I think my brain's just like confused because I make the typos so often. But anyways, <laughs> anyways, um, yeah, that's my one problem with this album. It's all in black and white. I don't like I don't like it very much. This music video itself is so cool, but like I feel like some of the other mu- mu- why um some of the other music videos on this would be so cool. Like Riptide, that would be so awesome with color, but no, it's just like black and white, black and white. Um, yeah, this one's cool though. Gorillas, yeah. I know I said I wasn't gonna do these guys, but like. I looked at their music videos and I was like, wait a minute, I have an opinion on this, actually. And it's different than yours, so take that. Uh-huh. So at number three, I put humility. <sighs> I just could not talk. <laughs> humility. I put humility. Um, it's just, f- it's just fun. I don't know. I would, this made me really just want to go skating, but, like, there's nowhere to skate here. Like, no one even walks outside here, so I don't know why, I don't, I don't want to just skate around. But, yeah, it just looks so fun to skate around. Jack Black is there for some reason. No one, no, no, no one knows why. Um, the animation is beautiful in this. I love Noodle in this so much. It's all just, like, it's just such a good vibes music video. Um, and at number two, I put Pac-Man. This was very close to being number one. I just, for some reason, I love this song so much. I don't, it's still... It's still unknown why. Um, the music video itself probably isn't good enough to be at number two, but I just had... I have... Um, I just love the song so much that it just automatically got put up here. Um, Russell... Everyone but Murdoch is really cool on this music video. Murdoch is just in a closet. I don't know. But 2D playing the game is pretty awesome. I really like Russell on this one where he's punching the bag on time with the drums. It was really cool. And Noodle, of course. Noodle is probably, this is probably one of her best music videos. I swear I'm dying right now. Um, yeah. And just the animation itself is so awesome on this one. I just, I wish they'd bring back the 2D animation. I'm sorry. The 3D animation looks a lot better now than it did in the humans era. But like, I mean, come on. Did you see it? the new album's going to release, like, soon? I did not know that. It's in, like, a couple of weeks, I think. Maybe a few weeks. I did I was not aware. I was not aware. Um, I felt like it, I felt a tickle on my, I felt a tickle on my leg, and I was so scared. Oh, I hate bugs. No, because I'm getting attacked by mosquitoes right now. I have mosquito bites all over my leg, and it is, it is January. It is January. There's snow outside right now. I don't know where they're coming from. I don't know what's happening. Um, yeah, honorable mentions, of course. So, you're gonna beat me up for this. You're literally gonna come to my house and beat me up. But this is not in my top three. I'm sorry. I, I really thought it was gonna be, but then I just thought about it, and I was like, I like them, I like the ones where they're doing stuff more. Like, 2D is amazing in this one. But, like, the other people in it, they're just, like, they're just playing, like, they're just playing their instruments. They're not doing much. And I just, I like seeing all of them just, like, live, like, in the human, not the humans one, in humility and stuff. Also, this is not my noodle. Not my, <laughs> hashtag not my noodle. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. 2D is great in this one. This is 2D's probably best music video, actually. Other than, what else would he be better in? Probably none. This is probably TD's best music video, actually. Yeah. Would you agree with that? You have to tell me. Is this TD's best music video? I can't think of anyone that would be better than this, actually. 
maybe maybe one of the demon days ones i don't know he's not that great in the music videos though on those he just looks creepy like this is he looks his best in this one i like him in um um what's that i for i suck at this in that human song where they go into the haunted house <laughs> what is it called it's like oh my life yeah that's <laughs> he's good in that one I, I like him in that one that's all i'm saying um and yeah he's <laughs> like i'm sorry i'm sorry oh shit. okay i guess we're moving on i guess we're moving on um so in number one i put momentary bliss because as i said i like all of them just living like they're just they're just a bunch of animated characters just living their best lives in this like murdoch drinks some poison um russell's just reading the newspaper noodles playing guitar and it looks so good it looks so good on like how do they animate her so well playing the guitar it is so cool looking and 2d is just like being himself you know he's just being all smiley and it's so cute also i love this british guy right here with the striped shirt i love him i don't know why <laughs> i don't know why his voice is just cool. Is he Damon? He can't be Damon. That's not Damon. I don't know. He's not featured on the track or anything, though, so it's weird. Um, yeah. Anyways, I don't even know. I don't know what he does. He sings, doesn't he? Does he sing for 2D in this? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah. It's just a fun music video. I love it. My profile picture on like youtube and google and stuff is actually 2d in this music video and it's been that for like years now actually that's kind of weird no it's been oh i've known them for over two years ew <laughs> that's not okay that's oh that's weird okay whatever whatever um now we're on to the random music videos so the ones that i was gonna put in was i was gonna put phineas in here then, like, I realized how long I was getting, and I was like, nah, that's just... So if you're really... If you're interested, watch Shelter by Phineas. I love that music video a lot. Um, and, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about that. So for the first one, look. Look. I don't know how I watched this music video. I don't know what possessed me to watch it. But it's a Harry Styles music video. And it's music for a sushi restaurant. <laughs> and it's extremely random. It's it's really new. It came out pretty recently. And it's about him being a mermaid. And it, like, he just sings and stuff. The sounds in it are just so satisfying. Like, just the sounds of them, like, chopping the fish up and stuff. Because it's a, it's a sushi restaurant. Like, it's cool. It's a fun little storyline. It's just, you know... Oh, no, it's because I saw something on, like, TikTok or something, and I was like, oh, Harry Styles with a beard, ew. And I was like, oh, I gotta see this for myself. And I watched this entire thing, and I was like, oh, wait, this is actually, like, fun. This is one of my favorite music videos. And it's it's weird. It's really random. Also, I don't know what's going on in the picture. I don't remember Shrimp playing the, the instruments, but, you know. Okay, and um, then we have GFY with Black Bear and Machine Gun Kelly. Um... <laughs> I don't know why Machine Gun Kelly is one of my favorite. These are just ones that my brain is like, oh yeah, you like those. So, um, again, I just watch, I just watch things to like quiet down my brain. And yeah, this is for sure one of the ones that do that. I really like Blackbird in this one. He's just like, he's just being a person in this. I really like his hair. He's just got the star thing. I always thought that looked great. Like I would never do it myself, but I seen it. What even happened to my grammar? I saw it um, on this girl on a React video once. Maybe it wasn't. It was like a Lifetime video or something. And she had her head shaved and she had hearts on it. And I was like in love with her. Um, naturally, of course. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I just like the vibes on this one. And I think he murders Machine Gun Kelly. No, I think Machine Gun Kelly is a murderer. This See... <laughs> See, I guess I can't really blame AJR for doing completely unrelated songs when this is literally Machine Gun Kelly murdering people and Black Bear being like, what are you doing, man? And then they both just end up singing in a shack at the end. Like, that just doesn't make sense. I can't I can't go after AJR. Um, yeah, I like the scene especially, though, where he's just, like, at the table and he's got his glasses on. For some reason, I just really 
like him in that. Um, and yeah. So these guys I haven't talked about yet. So I, f- I listened to these guys in October while you were gone. They're called, they're called The Bad Sons. Um, you know this song. I think I added it to the playlist a while back. I don't know if you remember it. Yeah, Cardiac Arrest. It's, I listened to the rest of this album and I like fell in love with it. Of course, I had like, I had a whole fixation on it for a while. Then I just moved slowly through all of their albums and I barely finished the last one like last month. Like I had an al- I literally had an album per month. But yeah, I really like these guys. They just have happy songs, you know? They just have like chill songs you can listen to and the guitar is really nice. Um yeah, this is one of my favorites of theirs though. It's Cardiac Arrest. This music video is just I can't even really remember what it's like that much. I was just listening to the song when I made this, so I was like, oh, you know what? Let's just throw this one in there. So, yeah. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have put it on. I just I just wanted to, like... I just wanted to be, like... I just wanted to say that Cardiac Arrest is a good song, pretty much. And I'll watch this music video afterwards, you know, and see if I really like it or not. I remember really liking it. Um, And here we have Chit Chat. This is Chit Chat by... um like oh it's beach weather it's beach weather these guys remind me a lot of the neighborhood like his voice sounds a lot like the neighborhoods or what's his stupid name the stupid guy that is the lead singer of neighborhood that's a child predator a child predator he's not a child oh jesse rutherford jesse rutherford i swear um yeah he's not a child predator but like you know anyways yeah um my mom even was confused. Like, we heard one of their songs come on the radio a few days ago, and she was like, wait a minute, so is this The Neighborhood? Is this that one band that you like? And I was like, no, this is um Beach Weather. But, yeah, they have this album, or I guess it's an LP. No, it's an EP. An album and LP are the same thing. It's an EP, and it has Chit Chat on it, and I love this song so much. It's just, their name really, they, live, they really live up to their name, this entire EP. I swear, I keep feeling like crawling things on me. This entire EP just sounds like the beach, you know? It sounds like summer. And that's what I love about this. Stop it. That's what I love about this one is just, like, it's really happy sounding. The guitars are so fun. It just sounds good. And it's just really colorful. I like it. Okay, and then we have Why Am I the One by Fun. I, I don't know where my mind went with this one. Honestly, like... I was just thinking about music videos and I, that I like, and I was like, you know what? Why Am I the One by Fun is, like, one of my favorite ones. I don't know why. I really like Nate Rose's face. That's the, middle, that's the middle guy right there. I just like looking at him for some reason. I like... I like his side profile a lot. Like, for some reason, his side profile just, like, is really satisfying to look at. But, yeah, this one's just... I this one's in an airport, and I just like it. There's really no good reason for liking it. I just like it. And I guess that's it. That didn't feel like too long of a time. I don't know. I guess we'll see. <laughs> I can talk for, like, hours and hours without realizing it, though. Like, rem- rem- remember the Gaten Matarazzo one? That was an hour long, but you didn't see it because I was like, oh, <laughs> no. I just deleted it and restarted it. <laughs> it was literally an hour, and I did not realize it. Oh, and I took it. Oh, I took that video at Alturas. That I really missed that actually. Oh, that was when we played the quarry for the first time. Oh, I missed Justice Smith. Anyways, that was I got so off topic so fast. Um, if it's over an hour long, I'm gonna cry. Yeah, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, thank you for letting me talk about these. That was it was fun. It was so fun. I really hope it wasn't that long. Because I... my Rest in peace to my phone, man. If it is that long. And, yeah. Love you. Bye.